And back locally, the Drainage Services Department today introduced new robots to increase maintenance, work efficiency and safety. The department aims to incorporate innovative technology into its work to handle adverse weather conditions and regular inspections. Mimo Singai reports. This machine is called the Mobile Powerful Pumping Robot. Recently introduced by the Drainage Services Department, this wireless water discharge robot is capable of draining 800 cubic meters of water per hour. It can be in operation for eight consecutive hours. These three wireless robots are for desilting purposes and can handle different drainage channel environments. The Drainage Services Department said the robots can support its work in handling incidents caused by adverse weather conditions, including flooding. To prevent flood water from overflowing in the city, the department is working on a barrier and nullar improvement scheme in Yunnan, a district that faces an increasing risk of flooding because of land development and climate change. The scheme includes building automatic flood barriers and stormwater pumping stations. The project started in May 2023 and authorities expect it to be finished by 2030. In a press conference, the Drainage Services Department said it would do its best to ensure the city will not be affected by their first weather this year. At the present stage, we haven't set any KPI, as we know, because of the uncertainty uh, of the adverse weather. It depends on the individual cases, that uh, how much time is required to handle and remove the flooding incident in each case. So it is not easy. I would say it's very difficult to set a universally applicable uh, KPI, for example, deployment or times to remove the uh, 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 for the incident, but we will do our best. Memos 9, TVB News.